how easy it is to actually cut this kind of metal with just an ordinary knife. It's just a kind of downward pressure, sideways pressure. Nice and easy. All oh, right. Okay. What are you up to? I am knocking holes into the bottom of this can to give a bit of airflow to our burn chamber. The sun has just come out. There we go. That's and I'm nice. using, as you can see, a hammer and a nail. As nice recommended <laughs> by the boss. <laughs> Who's that? I was going to drill it with my very expensive battery drill. This seems to work perfectly, adequately. And you'll find it's actually a lot quicker to do this <laughs> than using yeah, a power drill. So now this, this. Yeah, so this is where you now need some gloves to now Going start like handling a, it because you can see. It's like a wood burner now. Yeah. And you can, can you hear that rocket kind of sound? Yeah. There you go, that's a nice decent rockets. Biochar cook stove going. Sound of oil. Well I suppose theoretically this should work. This is more advanced principle than that one, isn't it? Because that's just a simple chimney, really. So here we have our biochar. And do you want to see if you can break that open? And look at that. Beautifully cooked all the way through. Wonderful. Mm -hmm.